what's good collective welcome back to another reading if you are new here what's up my name is magica and if you are returning welcome back welcome back welcome back all right so i have a quick channel message for y'all i don't think this is gonna be too long but um the song i'm picking up for this channel message today is i don't know what it's called actually uh, but it goes, shorty swing my way, sure looks good to me, so would you please swing in my way, shorty swing my way. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that's what I'm hearing. <clears throat> and I feel like somebody is trying to figure out a way to get you to swing their way. Um... And I feel like whoever this is, I feel like this is somebody who you are um, familiar with. And for others of you, this is somebody who you don't know. Well, I feel like you know this person in passing, okay? I don't feel like y'all have actually um, dated each other or anything like that. Y'all could just run around in the same um, uh, friend circle or whatever the case may be. But whoever this is, I feel like... For those of you who know this person, I feel like their ex may have gotten away in your connection. And for those of you who don't know this person and this person is interested in um, getting you to come their way, they're trying to get their ex out the way, okay? Because I feel like somebody's ex is a cock blocker. So um, I don't know where you guys are at on the side of the fence, but, you know, put yourself wherever you are okay but i do feel like um who ever this person is they're seeing you as not really interested in the bullshit okay <laughs> not really interested in what they may got going on for those of you who are dealing with somebody who you already know whose baby mama or ex may have gotten away they feel like you may not be interested in pursuing the connection uh the way that you once were but two 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 on the time as i said that but i feel like this person wants to try anyways okay and i feel like this person is doing what they can to get their um ex out the way okay so let's tap in let's tap in i feel like this person is moving their ex out the way to get to you i'm seeing that uh that scene from um <laughs> um white chicks where marlon wayans is running to the bathroom he's like boo bitch <laughs> like he knocking shit over knocking people over to get to the bathroom and stuff like that yeah that's what i'm saying <laughs> this is funny yeah i feel like this person is cleansing people out of their energy okay um getting people out the way i also feel like this person may have been on lockdown when it comes to uh not giving their their stuff away to their pp pee -pee or their JJ, whoever it is that you deal with um so this person could be on lockdown when it comes to that too okay they ain't giving up none to nobody that ain't you and that's just my period yeah okay so let's see i feel like this person finds I'm hearing love and happiness. <laughs> this person feels like they found love and happiness with you. And for others of you, for this person that wants to pursue you that you have not yet got to know on that type of level, this person feels like they can have, they can find love and happiness with you. It's something about you that um, satisfies them already. And they haven't even, you know, dipped their toes just yet. <laughs> Alright, Holy Spirit, let's go ahead and tap in. Let's tap in, tap in, tap in. So, for some of y'all, um, for those, I feel like I'm going to keep bouncing back and forth. Hopefully, I don't. I hopefully, it settles on one and then it just resonates for all. But um, there's something about a small situation being a test or something like that. Maybe this person was tested. I'm not sure, but you know. Let's go ahead and take it. Tell me about this energy of showing me my way in the spirit. I feel like 
somebody's ex know that knows that um they're interested in you for sure and that's why i feel like somebody um <laughs> is mad and is trying to cock block because your person don't want them or whoever the person that's interested in you don't want their ex they're like nah i'm not about to do no third parties like I'm not about to juggle you and juggle this person. Like, it, whatever it is that we had, it's a wrap. Like, somebody, it's out of question. And I feel like somebody is trying to figure out, well, why? Like, trying to ask all these questions. And it's because of you, Collective. Okay. <clears throat> Since the first time they seen you. And something about the very, a very sincere smile that you have. I don't know. You stay on somebody's mind. All right. Sorry, I'm channeling a lot. I ain't even get to the damn pulling the cards yet. I'm just doing a lot of channeling, so forgive me, y'all. Some of y'all may actually feel this person's energy a lot. All right. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Tell me about this shortest thing on the way. Energy. Yeah, okay, so this person is definitely, um, they don't got no feelings for nobody that ain't you. And that's just a wrap. It's something about you that sticks out among the rest. You see how these, it's just, you know, but it's something about her that's just like, damn. Okay, and I feel like people can be wondering, like, what does he see in her? Psh, you see that ethereal being right there? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? I also feel like you could be one who can switch it up is a lot to collective. You may have different sides of you, different personalities, or you know, um, maybe you change up your hair a lot, or maybe it's the way that you dress. You're very versatile and shit. Okay, but yeah, I feel like this person ain't got feelings for nobody who ain't you. I'm here, Chris Brown, with you, with you, with you, with you, and you. <laughs> ah, yeah, this person feels like y'all can take over the world, Pinky. <laughs> like, it's something about benefiting with you. This shorty sort of my way. Energy Holy Spirit. They feel hella, hella connected to you. For um, those of you who are dealing with somebody that you already know, this is a familiar person. Um, Y'all could have had like a friends with benefits situation or just like a little small fling or something like that. Um... And I feel like it went deeper than you guys expected. I feel like y'all didn't feel, y'all didn't expect to feel so connected to each other. Okay. For some of y'all, this person didn't feel like y'all put a low key spell on them. <laughs> but uh, nah, y'all are the magic. This person can feel like you're connected to the spirit in some type of way or um, connected to the universe. Connected to God. This person can see you as a very spiritual person. It's something about the magnetic um, connection that you guys have with each other. Some of y'all got a bomb ass body too. You can be uh, curvy in the right places or thick in the right places or whatever. Some of y'all can have your hair braided up in a ponytail right now. Oh, this person is declining people left and right for you. 
This person is not playing. Okay, so they're getting rid. They're getting rid of their roster or something like that. Cause I feel like y'all wasn't um in an actual relationship or anything like that. I feel like this was just you know a little casual fling or something like that. Nothing too serious, but it got serious. And I feel like now this person is in this energy of like, damn, hold on. Um, <laughs> this is a connection I need to protect. This is a connection that I need to cherish. This is a connection that I need to pursue. And they are cutting off all their little, uh, whoever they was with, whoever they had lined up, they cut them off, okay? Period. All right, tell me more. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. What's going on? This energy. Hmm. Spiritual bath. I can't make it up. They're cutting everything off for this connection. I feel like whoever, what they're just cutting off jealous ass people. Because these people who are jealous of this connection, I feel like it's this ex for sure. And it's because they're serious about you and they want to take this connection serious. So I feel like somebody is in their feelings because it's you. <laughs> the Empress, it's all about you, baby. This person feels a connection with you that they ain't never felt with nobody else. This person could also want to get you pregnant or they just see you as somebody who is very abundant on their own, um, very independent, very beautiful. You have your own garden. It's like you, you're just kind of watering everything around you right now. It's giving oasis, babe. <laughs> this person could want to take you all to a spa or there's something about a spa. Something about Palm Springs, Hot Springs. Someone can also want to go get a massage or something like that or recently got a massage. Or maybe you're pampering yourself or doing your self-care. This person loves the way that you keep up on yourself. Yeah, this person is hella attracted to you, okay? Hella attracted. I feel like this person could um, also spy on your um, your social media a lot to look at your pictures and stuff like that. <laughs> okay, you fine, girl or boy, whoever y'all are, y'all fine as hell. I feel like it's gonna come to you, come as a surprise when this person comes in because I feel like this person is about to let you know that they are so sure about you. They want to let you know how special you are to them and how they want you to stay in their life. They want to grow with you. They want to put you in this place of ease as well because I feel like you put them in a place of ease. There's something about you um, making them feel safe or feeling like they can just lay their head down. But I feel like Whatever it is they had going on, they had to pay for it. In the past, they the, whatever past they got going before they had gone before they met you and stuff like that. Before they started getting serious with you, it's a price they got to pay for it in order to get to you. Yeah, it's a price they got to pay for their peace. And I feel like these are things they didn't want to worry your head about or anything like that. All right. Somebody's trying to move very smart when it comes to this connection. I feel like somebody's um, really strategizing to get y'all on the same page. All right, tell me more. Holy Damn, there is too much going on here. Whew. Yeah, if this, I swear, this person definitely had a roster. Somebody was a little player, okay? Somebody had them hives. <laughs> I'm here, like I was saying, what's up with them hoes tonight? <laughs> 
Yeah, so I look, so I was not really in the energy of wanting to fall in love and shit like that, but it's something about you that made them change their mind or change up their tune, okay? Because they're not walking like they were walking <laughs> before they met you, okay? You got somebody, ooh, ooh, ooh. You got somebody wanting to pump their brakes when it comes to um, dealing with other people, Okay, so I feel like it could be catching people off guard. They're like, damn, what the fuck? We're like, I thought we had whoop de whoop going and whoop do 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 No, not anymore. Not anymore. Somebody's like, yeah, so about that, all that was temporary. It ain't what you thought it was. Like... <laughs> Okay, so now I feel like somebody is out here breaking hearts, clearing the path so they can get to you. Jesus Christ, it came out again. It came out again. Yep. Mm hmm. Getting rid of the bitches or the ninjas who, whatever. All right, what else? Let me see. I'm, uh, yeah, so this person is having hope for this connection. Um, as they clear out whatever it is they need to clear out because y'all got people trying to talk like their connection. I could have feel like it put a little damper on it a little bit, okay? You could have thought this person was playing games. You could have thought this person was kind of rejecting you or something like that or just really didn't want what you wanted. But that's not what it was. This person had to um, clear out their past, okay? Clear out the karmic. Cause it's all about you. They're attracted to you. Also, yeah, there's something about uh, <laughs> somebody really feel like somebody put a spell on them or something like that. But that's not even the case, baby. You're the magic. It's all about you, and that's it. You're the magic, baby, and that's all about it. Okay. Yeah. So somebody could have been trying to control them. You know, keep their energy down in the dumps. Keep them doing the same shit. I feel like somebody didn't mind being um, a side piece or something like that. Somebody like, you can juggle me and her. No, 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 we can't. No, we can't. Somebody, <laughs> no, you can't. So you're going to have to figure that out. Because, <laughs> uh-uh. Okay? So... I feel like this person had to strategize, um, figure out their plans to get out of this whole situation that they put themselves in by, I'm hearing, I'm a gigolo, spending lots of dough, da, 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 da. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, he said something about the show, so maybe some of y'all, um, that person could, uh, be in a, a public eye or they just attract a lot of people i'm hearing don juan so this person just get a lot of bitches it is what it is whether they get attention for what they do or they just get attention because they look good they got a lot going for themselves and you know they just so, so rico suave out this bitch <laughs> like Okay, but for some of y'all, uh, this person could um, be in a spotlight in some type of way. Yeah, this person wants you to have their kids for sure. They feel like you are fine as mine. This person is this person is really ready to give up their... And they, I'm not even saying really ready to give up. They already did. Like... <laughs> <clears throat> Somebody already made it in your made it up in their mind that you're theirs. 1919 on the timer as I said that that can be significant for some of y'all. But you got Shay Jennifer, count me out. And it says to my next girl, I want to give the world. So if you ain't looking for world, uh, if you ain't looking for love, then count me out. This person has found love within you. Okay. I hear we're not even trying to look for it. But this person is in the energy of like, yeah, this the one right here. Yep. I love you. Look at that. 
I love you. Mm. Yeah, this person wants to uh, give you a ring, possibly. Shit, the way that they talking. But yeah, I feel like y'all had to go through, um, y'all went through a couple things with this person because they per they may have seen like they were very closed off, cold and distant and stuff like that. But that's because this person was, they was out here doing a little thing. I probably won't sit there and hold you. I feel like this person um, had a little ice box surrounding their little heart. And I feel like it was because of the ex, okay? Maybe things that they've been through with this person in the past. I also feel like it was just, they just wasn't in the energy of really looking. But... <laughs> They done fucked around and found out with you. Okay, me what you say by Eric Bellinger is out here. So I feel like this person is going to take you serious. Whatever it is that they've been saying to you about this connection, um, whatever feelings that they have admitted to you, um, I feel like they mean it. It says, when I say, when it comes to you, I'm sorry. It says, when I say, when it comes to me, you're enough for me. You the one for me. Trying to trust again is kind of tough for me. Just know I mean it. So this person may have cut off their heart chakra due to um, past traumas, trust issues, and stuff like that. So they could have felt like, oh, well, you know, when they met up with you and stuff like that, you was just going to be part of their roster. They thought that they was just going to be, you know, it was just going to be a whole little fling, a little casual situation. But it's the connection that y'all got. It's something about the powerful connection y'all have to where this person was like, nah, I can't do that to this person. Like, my heart not even saying no. I, I, I'm i trying to decline my own feelings. I feel like this person tried to deny their own feelings for you. But and tried to, you know... Uh, drown it out by dealing with other people and going out and partying and da, da 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 But they could not stop thinking about you. They could not stop thinking about you. That's why I feel like somebody feel like you put a spell on them. <laughs> Look, truth is at the bottom of the deck, I never got over you. Exactly. Exactly. Thank you, Holy Spirit. So this person is going to be finding their way back. Jaheen. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. If you guys are interested in this deck, y'all can find that down in the description below. Um, or just click on my little shop, my little products on my YouTube uh, community tab thingy, or however that shit works. Y'all be able to purchase it there. But yeah, uh, baby. <laughs> you done turned this person's world upside down. All right, what else, Holy Spirit? I know what you want from me. I'm just scared to give it to you. Ooh. So this person knew that you wanted commitment. Okay. Because you felt the connection just as much as they did. But I feel like they were the one that was holding back. They were the one being in denial about their uh, feelings. Trying to deny it and shit. So um, they just held back. You know, they didn't, they didn't give in to the connection like they really wanted to. I feel like this is something that they had a hard time making a decision towards because they've had their heart broken before. Oh, and as I say that, I'm scared you're going to hurt me. Exactly. This person felt just as much as you felt for them. They really did. But they got scared. They got scared. But I feel like this person is ready to step up now. They're ready to actually be in a relationship with you. Somebody does not want to lose out on this opportunity with you. All right, let's get two more cards, Holy Spirit. Have you been thinking of me like I've been thinking of you? That came out in reverse. So I really feel like this person has been trying their best to get you off their mind. But that shit ain't working, okay? And I feel like this person is actually also in this energy of tired of thinking about you. They're ready to come forward. Like, come on out. Yeah, I told my friends about you. Ooh, so they told their friends about the situation and how they ran. They told them about how you wanted a relationship, but they kind of got scared and punked out. Like, ah! 
But this person has been daydreaming about what it would be like if y'all was to end up in a relationship and stuff like that. They've been thinking about this heavily. I feel like they've also been telling their friends how heavily that they've been thinking about it. I feel like they've been telling them like, damn, I've been trying to shake this girl, but I can't. Yeah, bottom of the deck, you make me want to love again. So you really got this person shook, okay? About you as I split the deck by blast. Mm, 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 mm. Would count me out again. Okay, yeah, so this person is trying to be about we. <laughs> okay, period. 25, 25 on the timer as I say that. They heard, they try, okay, so they speaking French now. We, we? Somebody wants to use we statements? What are we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> all right so this person is wondering if you miss them and if you want the same thing all right let's get one more card from this holy spirit yeah gone because y'all are definitely in separation right now um and it was only because that they weren't feeling ready to be in this connection but now that they are feeling ready to be like and be in this connection because i feel like first of all I feel like this person had a revelation like you're not like their past. You're not their past ex. You're not like other people that they dealt with who betrayed them in some type of way or deceived them or lied or cheated or whatever it is that they did that caused this person to have trust issues. You're nothing like that. You're nothing like that. And I feel like this person is finally realizing that. They're getting out of their own way. They're removing their fears. And stuff like that, okay? Hmm. Period. Period. I love that. All right, let's get some messages from this person. And this is going to go ahead and uh, and we'll get initials and then we'll end it out. <clears throat> okay, where's that deck going to use? It's very small, so I'll be losing it. We've been together for lifetimes. Mm, so y'all may definitely have, that's why it, it feels so, y'all feel so connected to each other. Because this is a past life connection. Makes sense. And this person is tired of running. Can you hear me whisper your name? So this person is definitely uh, pulling on your energy. If you guys been seeing a lot of signs, synchronicities, things that just point to this person, um, they're definitely pulling on your energy. They're definitely manifesting you. I feel like that's their way to let you know that they'll be coming back soon. I'm here. Be patient. Be patient. Yeah, it came out again. We've been together for lifetimes. <laughs> All right, give me a couple more. What's the point of it all? And it fell on top of all, it, it fell on top of mad hoes. So this person is just like, why am I running around with these bitches or giving these hoes my energy for what? When I'm in love with the collective or when I, when the collective is all that I need, like, why am I, why? What is the point of it all? Like this, this is stupid. I'm here. This is stupid guys. Is this camera on? This is stupid. Like, this person is realizing how stupid it is. Like, they got this bomb-ass connection with you, yet they're treating you like an option. Somebody feels dumb. They're like, nah, this is dumb. I need to stop this stupid shit because, mm-mm, you're mine forever and ever. Yeah, mm-hmm, period. <laughs> you have to be patient. I told y'all. It's something about y'all need to be patient because they are cutting off everybody. When I say they are snip snipping, bitch, they are snip snipping. Okay. I dream about a future with you. Told y'all. And I dream about you at night. Oh my God. When I this person at night is the worst time for them. Okay. The worst time. Because I feel like everything at the end of the day, when they're just trying to wind down, all thoughts come to you. All thoughts is damn. I miss the collective. All thoughts is damn. I want to be with the collective. Da, 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 da. Like damn. Look, do you miss me the way I miss you? Like, uh, 
Yeah, I really got this person, but they want you to be patient because they are doing the work to cut off every goddamn body that they need to cut off. I also feel like this person is working through their fears and insecurities when it comes to you and this connection because I feel like the type of love that you are showing this person is knocking the wind out their body, okay? It, mm, 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 mm. <clears throat> Somebody ain't never had this before. I mean, I ain't, I ain't never had. I'm trying to see what that be like. Like, <laughs> all right. Let's get a couple more messages from this person, and then we're gonna get initials, and I'm gonna end it out. This is a beautiful reading. Okay, because they about to do their stuff. They about to do their big one. I really want to kiss you. Mm -hmm. I want to make new memories with you. This person wants to be with you, babe. Okay, and that is evident. That is so evident. Somebody's like, I don't give a damn about nobody else. Them hoes can kick rocks, skedaddle, whatever, bitch. Whatever you want to call it, they can do. They are free to roam around to the next country, whatever. I need to heal my inner child wounds. Okay, so this person is definitely um, doing some type of healing. Okay, I also feel like this person could have had some type of abandonment issues too. But whatever it is that they're needing to heal, they're working on it. What else, Holy Spirit? Give me a couple more messages from this person. I feel like I'm going to pull channel messages too. I want to talk to you, but I don't know what to say. That's what I'm sorry. <laughs> I know I need to work on myself. Okay, yeah. So this person knows for a fact that they need to work on themselves. And that's why they aren't saying much. That's why they aren't talking to you. I don't feel like it's because they don't know what to say. It's just that the fact that they're not ready to come forward yet. Somebody knows that they have some work to do. Okay. They want to be able to make you smile. They want to be able to come to you properly. Okay. They want to step up right. So I'm going to pull from here, get a couple of these, Holy Spirit, get a couple of these, please. You are who I want, nobody else. <laughs> Didn't I tell you? You are who I want, nobody else. And I also feel like this person knows that you don't play that type of shit. You don't play that third party type of shit. You're not the you're not the one to do that. You're not the one. The Empress don't do third parties, baby. You either going all in with her or you leaving her alone. And that's just that on that, baby. All right, tell me more. Give me a couple more, Holy Spirit, before I pull from the the box. My little index box. I can hear. I'm hearing. I can tell by um, Eric Bellinger. It keeps running in my hair, my head, and I feel like that's low key a message towards them, ride or die. Um, Cause it goes. I know you ain't fell in love in a minute. I can tell. I can tell. I can tell, and then, and so you ain't made love in a minute. I can tell. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. So this, mm, I feel like this person ain't been loved on in so long. Not genuine love. I don't even think this person know what genuine love is. Feel like until you came around this whole. Lay your body down by Pretty Willy. Okay. Again, this person don't want to um, uh, lay down with nobody else either because that came out under you are who I want nobody else. So if you have any inklings or any thoughts that this person is um, having relations with somebody else, I promise you they're not. They see you as their ride or die and somebody got their shit on lock. Okay celibacy popping because somebody like uh-uh you hoes ain't worth it i love you like a fat kid loves cake <laughs> okay period thank you for opening your heart up to me even when i didn't deserve it oh see they knew they knew that they was on some bullshit in the beginning or 
whenever it is that they were just being very closed off, but you continue to stay, you know, your loving self, period. We are so much alike, yes, so different. So this person <laughs> feels like you are them just in another body, okay? But y'all still have like things about y'all that make each other different. I love that. Choke me, spank me, pull my hair. Okay, so this person wants to get nasty. And that's just it. I feel like you're the best this person ever had, too. You jump timelines. Okay, so there's definitely some type of energy shift in this connection. So you need to know that. I feel like things are definitely about to speed up. I'm getting the Eight of Wands. I'm seeing the Eight of Wands in my third eye. Yeah, reconciliation is around the corner. You need to know that this person is definitely getting out of their um, their uh, self-sabotaging um, ways, for sure. Mm. Okay. I'm not going to pull no tarot. I was about to, but I don't want to make this too long. <laughs> All right, so give me a few more messages, Holy Spirit, and we out of here. You have a lot of eyes on you. Okay, so remember I said somebody is very attractive, somebody that um, gets a lot of attention, whether it's you or this person. I feel like it's both of y'all. Yeah, you thought I was going to allow you to play in my face? Exactly. <laughs> you was like, uh-uh, you got me fucked up. Especially if they were, um, um... Uh, Thought they was going to juggle you with their roster. You could have probably peeped, like, what you thought this was? Like, mm -hmm. no, 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 baby. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, this P slash D is voodoo. So they definitely feel like you got to hold on them. I don't care. Whatever it is that you be doing in the bedroom. Woo, you turned this person out. Playing both of y'all in tandem. See, yeah, this person thought they were going to be able to do that. Uh-uh. Not over here, boo. Not over here. Not over here. But they realized they didn't want to do that anyways, especially after they um, <laughs> spent a lot of more time with you and realized just how deep the connection was with y'all, okay? I knew not to play with you, but I still did. Mm-hmm. 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 They knew not to play with you, and they still did, and they're paying for it. They're paying for it. They was paying. They're paying for it. Yeah. Okay. For some of y'all, can be part of the LGBTQ plus. Okay. I'm loyal to you, so they want you to know that they're loyal to you, despite everything that may have happened between y'all. They're loyal. Ohio, Oklahoma, and Oregon may be significant. All right, Holy Spirit, give me a few more to bring this message together. Slow burning connection. Okay, so some of y'all need to know that this is definitely a slow burning connection. This is something that's going to be um, taking its time so y'all can actually get to know each other and um, create this this bond, this foundation, this friendship, okay? I want that. It's giving homie lover friend, okay? <clears throat> this, shit, this is going to be a connection where... Y'all are together for a very, very, very long time. If not, death do y'all part, okay? <laughs> All right. The letter B can be significant. Can I hit it in the morning? Okay, some of y'all may need to get a plan B, okay? Especially if you ain't thinking about getting pregnant, babe. Time to get grounded, okay? Go out in nature and touch some grass. Okay, so if some of y'all been feeling a little bit, you know, too much of a sexual energy and stuff like that, you have not been around this person, maybe you need to get grounded. Maybe you need to go touch some grass, you know, ground your energy a little bit, okay? I don't mind running a red light, okay? So be careful. Be careful with all that, all right? Uh, but this also gave me this energy of this person wanting to um, stay connected with you, okay? I'm going to give you everything you deserve, period. 
this person wants to give you everything that you deserve, everything that they could not give you in the beginning because they were too busy being scared of their feelings and running around and doing all this extra stuff. They want to make up for all that. Okay, and the initials MPZ is here. I'm going to pull one more since that came out for initials. Actually, I'm going to pull two more because we got to be here too. So I'm going to pull two more because they came out as initials because we're already about to get initials. I haven't shared your dick with anyone. I'm on lockdown for you. Did not tell. Did not tell y'all, and I'm pulling out these. Y'all see all these? Did I told y'all this person ain't giving they thing away? Ooh, they ain't giving that thing away. They ain't giving it away. No, 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 no. They knocking these bitches to the side. Watch out! Bow, bow, bow. <laughs> All right, my bad. <laughs> Okay, I have pure intentions. I want to invest in us. So, yeah, this person ain't into trying to juggle you with other people, okay? They feel like they found their match with you, and they feel like it's time to pursue this with pure intentions. They ain't got no, they ain't trying to have no second agenda. Somebody ain't trying to have no hidden motives or anything like that. Somebody's coming pure intent, okay? One more, Holy Spirit. <sighs> Wearing the clothes you bought me comforts me. So, y'all could have bought this person some clothes or something like that. Or maybe they bought you some clothes or something. Or whatever it is that you bought them, they keep on them, okay? Or they hold it or whatever the case may be. Um, so, you know, because it comforts them. And I pulled an extra one. Your mind is sexy. So y'all need to know it's just not about your appearance. It's nothing about your appearance. It has nothing to do with your physicality. It doesn't have nothing to do with the, the sex you guys have. It's all about how you think, how you carry yourself, how you move out in the world, how you love this person, how genuine you are, okay? you. I'm hearing whole package. Mm -hmm. The whole package. I'm hearing um, that song by uh, Skilla Bay featuring Flo Millie. Yeah, you the whole package, baby. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get some initials and see what other confirmations I can come up with. Well, that I channel, not come up with, <laughs> but you know. I don't know what it's good. Okay. Mm. Somebody can be washing right now. Something about the washer and dryer. I'm also hearing what would Jesus do. So I feel like they have been um, trying to follow their higher self. They've been praying to God to get some guidance on this connection. Oh, this person been going to God about you. I also feel like this person feels like y'all will be dope together. <laughs> like y'all will be dope together. It's something about y'all having a bright future. Y'all being able to, you know. Mm-hmm. I'm hearing two peas in a pod. Oh. Partner in crime. Y'all so cute. Yeah. Someone's also working on money. They can be building their finances. I feel like you could be building your finances as well, or y'all are just both focused on career. There's something about a wad of cash or a wad of money or something like that. So maybe somebody's finances are just on the up and up, or they're becoming on the up and up. Let's see. What else, Holy Spirit? So my name can be Greg, Gregory. Juwan Franklin <laughs> This man this person wants you to have their last name. I'm seeing wed. I'm seeing I do. So my name can be AJ.
something about some type of pictures. I don't know if y'all got pictures together or something like that. Somebody can recently watch that episode of P-Valley. Somebody can be a truck driver. Somebody can be from North Carolina. Norfolk. Norfolk, I'm hearing. I'm hearing, yeah, that's a city, right? Norfolk. I don't think it's a city in North Carolina, but I'm hearing Norfolk. I think that's Virginia, right? I don't know, bitch. <coughs> Y'all tell me. Um, what else? Someone can own a, a, a gun because I'm seeing Pew and I'm seeing FN. <laughs> So maybe somebody likes to go to the gun range. Somebody can uh, have a license to carry. Or maybe, the, I don't want to say a throwaway, but, you know, somebody can have, a, like, a little a legal piece as well. I don't know. Put it where it fits. Somebody can also like grapes. Somebody can have the name Grace or Gracie, or this person wants you to give them Grace. Somebody's name can be Victor, Vicky, Victoria, Valerie. Something about Wednesday. Wednesday can be significant. So maybe this Wednesday, next Wednesday, or just Wednesday in general. Maybe something went down on a Wednesday. Okay. Somebody could have recently watched Deadpool. Yeah, that Deadpool Wolverine movie. I'm seeing that here too. <clears throat> and something about princess and a frog somebody's name can be Deja Javon Jovi Javi and somebody can own a dog All right, the initials we have are D, W. Ha, that's funny. Somebody could like uh, the Bernstein Bears, the Bernstein Bears. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, and it ain't Bernstein, bitch. It's Bernstein. The, that Mandela effect, bitch, it was the Bernstein Bears when I was a kid. Okay, I just had to get that off my chest. <laughs> All right, the initials we got is D W N Z Q N V I J D um, C O X P and A. Okay. I wasn't saying the letter K, I'm just saying okay, but maybe K. So that could be significant for somebody. Um, yeah. All right, Collective. This is all I have for y'all tonight or today or whenever you're watching this video. All right. If it resonated for y'all in any type of way, please like, comment, and subscribe if you already haven't. Share this message with someone you feel may need to hear it. And continue to help your girl get to 5,000 subscribers because once I get there, I will be giving away two free readings. Also, if you're interested in booking a reading with me, all that information will be down in the description box below. Until next time, my loves. Bye.